Hello everyone, welcome to the channel Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Taurus and Taurus Moon and Taurus Rising Weekly Tarot and Lenormand Reading for August 27th to September 2nd, 2018. So, <clears throat> first we are, going, we are going to do the Tarot Reading for, um, for Taurus and the first position for you Tauruses will represent the topic of your week second position will refer to the core of your situation third position third position will resemble the uh, challenges you have to face for the duration of the week and then uh, we do have the fourth position here which will give us the understanding of the guidance that it is um, favorable for you to follow for the duration of uh, of this week so let's see what you do have here now the first card that will be the King of Wands, for what it seems, <clears throat> and as we were speaking about the topic of the week and the Queen and the King of Wands, it uh, does look like that this week is going to be quite ambitious for you. For, for what it seems, uh, you are going to place a, a very high goals, or it is favorable for you to place a high goals in front of yourself. <clears throat> And when we talk about a, a high goals here, it is truly um, essential for your behalf to really show your presence as a natural born leader. And that could happen by um, not by the by the quality of not making uh, any mistakes along the way. Of course, we are people and we do mistakes here. But when it comes to the Queen of, to the King of Wands, this is a, a person who always keeps their positive attitude and always is ready to find even better solution to the solution thus persisting into one certain uh, predicament. So, therefore, uh, this week, for what it seems, by having here the Queen of Wands, it does look like that you are going to find more efficient way to cope with your um, either daily routine with uh, with your career or with your relationship friendships friendships etc etc these people are going to start building up even more and more trust in your Tauruses and that is a, a very favorable uh, position here that you are going to obtain for the duration of the week to attack even higher um, milestones than, than those that you have in this very moment especially for those who are jobless and they're seeking for a job that kind of promises to them or kind of gives them the opportunity to uh, attack a higher position that they currently have in mind until this very moment now the second card here for you is going to represent the core of the situation or why uh, you have that topic of the week and this is going to be the Knight of Wands that will express or kind of signify a, a person that will be in touch with you in one or um, another in, in yeah in one or another way this person is going to give you um, I can't really say example but with their presence with their behavior and in general with the community uh, um, through the communication with them and is how you are going to uh, boost your self-confidence seeing that these people that person here they never give up so even if they face against a, a wall uh, they don't back down and they take on the challenge they try find a way to break through that wall uh, through experimenting with the means that they do have at their behalf and this is truly going to encourage you and when you uh, make a, a thorough analyze of what you have as a means at your behalf you will kind of like reach the um, the insight here that you can achieve much more than you are sitting at at this very moment so uh, just based on these couple of cards that week Tauruses for you should be founded upon uh, kind of being more prone to uh, do something not heroic you know but uh, way um, way more challenging that you are used to do right now and through the challenge it is where the improvement comes so just to give you a couple of example here to give you a glimpse of idea that could be you um, take a participation you may decide that you are ready to take a participation into a project thus far um, 
unthinkable for you to involve yourself in or uh, these couple of cards could signify that you uh, have a person of interest which kind of surpasses your expectations in any way and you are finding out for yourself that you are quite I can't say really worthy here but capable you know of to seize that person of interest for yourself that uh, by but by now you know you have thought that you have no chance whatsoever so it's kind of like you know uh, expanding your um, your field of capabilities for what it, for what it seems here um, with these cards and if you do have a certain difficulties with communication with people or um, your relationship here suffers setbacks as I said these cards pointing that you will find a, a better way uh, for uh, through that throughout the week to cope with those um, insufficient ways of um, you know dealing with your situation in your relationships now the next card here points to the challenges that you have to overcome this is going to be the two of wands and this card speaks only one thing here it's uh, over aggression and lack of patience the the situation to unfold naturally so and that is kind of understandable now you know that uh, uh, just to just to give you the idea here, you know, you kind of like being uh, humbled about your current state and suddenly you find, you realize that you can um, expand or can suffuse on a much greater scale here and therefore one wants to suffuse immediately straight away, one wants to kind of capitalize on um, <clears throat> those thus far unres unresearched opportunities uh, and wants to do it in one blink of an eye and that will not happen really I mean you can capitalize on them but not in a blink of an, in a blink of an eye and when we do have the two of wands into a challenging position first and foremost you have to um, you have to take a precautionary measures to uh, not lose what you have uh, achieved for yourself thus far before you actually start uh, kind of lifting the bar of your expectations and about uh, the bar of your aims as well now the, now don't freak out if you can't find the best way possible um, or the best field to exert yourself this particular week as this comes as a challenge as well with the two of wands because some of you Tauruses may feel that you have so much to give but there is no one or nothing in there that wants what you are what you have to offer that should not put you into a state of despondency eventually this that kind of a circumstances or such kind of a person who wants what you have to offer will come around all right but it may not happen in this particular week and as we said about the king of wands here you can find a a better way to exert yourself into situations and into people so you can definitely redirect your frustration into a more constructive manners um, by coping with people and uh, exerting communication with them so uh, the last card here represents the guidance that you should uh, adopt or kind of the approach you should take toward your situation we do have the magician card and that is about learning so it's kind of like it it does solidify the two of wands but as well it does solidify the king of wands either so <clears throat> What happens here is that you, uh, if you give yourself a little bit of a time, like a couple of hours, you know, or a day to think about why you are feeling yourself uh, not worthless, but let's say useless, because as I said, you will have much to give, but you will not know where to give it or whom to give it to, all right? So, um, and this may, as I said, cause a, um, a feeling of uh, uselessness. So if you try to examine that particular feeling, you're going to realize that maybe you are lacking a certain knowledge, maybe qualification as well, or um, friends connections. What, what was I searching for? Followers here. So the best way to approach the situation 
having the magician card first things first is to win followers to obtain followers that stand behind behind your agenda then you need to use your um, communicational skills to explain really what you're trying to do and how you're going to achieve it now you need to know that people will somehow blindly believe in, in your in your words or in your methods as well and that uh, that itself asks from you to put a high amount of determination uh, behind your actions whatever actions you take for the duration of the week and as well the uh, the magician is about sovereignty so whatever happens here you should not jeopardize your sovereignty in any case <clears throat> When it comes to communicating with people and when it comes to relationships, either a friendship relationship or a, a romantic relationship here, uh, it all comes again to communication and to the mutual uh, acceptance. So uh, what I mean here is, is that you should not try to change the person that stands uh, next to you or in front of you but rather you need to accept them the way they are if you are incapable to accept them the way they are then things will not unfold very positively for neither of you and so uh, let's see now what the Lenormand has to say for you now the first card here that we do have for you Taurus is this is going to be the book followed by the dog and the final card that we do have for you, that will be the cross. So this three cards does not affect you directly. What happens, what Dylan, what Dylan Norman says about you and the, uh, the event that will happen to you here, Taurus, is, is that you will come to knowledge that a friend of yours is suffering. And uh, they haven't shared that burden with none around you nor with you. So this is typically a person who always puts a brave smile on their face, always says that it is okay while they are not okay, all right? This is the person who goes through turmoil, who is walking through a, a turmoil, experiencing a, a, a heavy setback either into their relationship or either into their career. And the, even if you ask them, are you or are you all right you know even if even if you ask them for um, to give them to offer them a help they never agree and they never say I will handle it well this week you will kind of understand the through the true magnitude of the um, of the trouble your very good friend is in and probably you will have the chance to offer your help once again and this time around your help will be gr um, very uh, gratefully received or gratefully taken excuse me so that being said Taurus is this was your weekly tarot reading and Lenormand 1 for uh, August 27 to September 2nd 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it guys and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down in the description of this video as well as this is the end of the summer sale and there is a, a promotion going for the 30 minutes um, live reading and as soon as you purchase a 30 minutes live reading it automatically becomes a 40 minutes live reading so if you want a an extra time and to save a little bit money and you want the reading with me while well, you do have an opportunity to do so so uh, that being said Brad signing out now see you next time bye